Hey guys, it's Colette Waters. I am taking over KC Creatives today, and I'm so excited for you guys to follow me along on my day, so let's go. So I have a home studio, which works out really nice for me. Um, it's just right when you come in, um, just got some hardwood, some white walls. It's not huge, but it has nice big ceilings, and it works out good for me. This is my main studio light. Um, I love it a lot. It's really great. It's a pro photo. Has the big soft box. I love it. And then I also have a ring light that I use for like continuous lighter. I also use a lot of natural light. So this is one reason why when we bought this house, like why I wanted this room and all of this natural light that comes in here. So when I do natural light, I just open up these windows, um, keep the, obviously the curtains down and when shooting in here, I either shoot on this white wall with the hardwoods um, or I use this white seamless or this black velvet, which I really like um, because it absorbs light and it's just dark. There's no shadows. I got this clothes rack at Ikea, which was a really great deal. Um, an even better deal was this sweet chair that I got at Savers Thrift Store for $10. I love it, especially for um, portraits. Pushed over to the side is my desk. Um, I have this sweet Mac. Um, I actually don't edit a lot on it. I edit on my laptop more just because usually I want to watch TV while I'm editing. But um, I do like work and all the boring stuff on this computer. When it comes to business cards, I really love Moo cards. So you can put multiple photos on one side of the card and they don't have a limit on that. And then you have all of your information on the other side. And it's just really high quality, nice and sturdy, really nice cards. These are also really nice when you shoot different things, so then whenever you're meeting with a future client, you can give them a card that correlates with them. So whether I'm going to be shooting a child, a guy, families, models, branding, seniors, headshots, I have some. Okay, so I have my food and coffee, of course. I love elephants in vogue um, okay so this is like where I do a lot of my editing on my couch very comfy um, and on my lap so about my editing I mainly use Photoshop I love Photoshop um, I use pass to deliver images and keep track of images I use blog stomp if I need to put my logo on a bunch of photos or just size a bunch of photos I try to stay organized just with simple folders. So I have um, past photos, photos that I need to blog and post, and then photos that I am currently editing. When I'm editing, I'm usually listening to like Lana Del Rey or Billy Joel. I, I know those are different, but those are like my two favorites. Um, or I listen to a lot of audiobooks, um, or I watch or have like The Office on in the background. Side note, I think that one of the most important things about being a portrait photographer is giving good customer service. So one thing that I do is I always ask my clients what kind of music that they like, and then I make them a special Spotify playlist. Other things I do um, for good customer service and add that special touch is giving thank you cards, special gifts, um, little welcome signs, anything that can make um, the photo shoot experience extra special. Okay, I got sidetracked with Spotify and everything. But anyways, so um, last night I did a shoot for Sierra Julian. Um, they are these really nice and cute kids clothes. Um, so I have just like these. I started. So I started going through these last night. The client, they just wanted a simple white background. We just shot with natural light up in my studio. Um, and we had two cute models. Mr. Bentley is with Hoffman Models. And... And then we had Miss Poppy as well. Um, we have really fun. We're keeping it pretty simple. Um, they are so cute. I am not going to edit these until the I send them to the client and then she'll let me know. What so photo shoots like this, I usually don't edit until I send them to the client and then they let me know which ones they want to be edited. Um, but with like portraits, I just go through and I choose the images. I usually do like 30 images and retouch them. So if you go to my website, you can see that my editing is pretty clean. I try to keep it timeless. Even so, I don't really like to show my unedited photos. So those last few posts I was showing, that was hard, guys. <laughs> okay, so I sent the photos to the client, Sierra Julian. 
since some time sensitive emails. Now I'm on my way to a shoot. I shoot with my Nikon D800. I have my 50 millimeter lens, my 35 millimeter, and my 85 millimeter. In my last post, I know I sounded out of breath because I was running around trying to get ready for my shoot. I'm on my way to do a family portrait session in their backyard. Earlier this week, I went ahead and scouted their yard so I know it's good to go. I meant to show you my camera bag. It's a Joe Totes, so it looks like a purse, but it's actually a nice camera bag. And then my also my little elephant guy I'll put on my camera lens um, because I know there's at least one kid in this family. Okay, I just got done shooting uh, a family and whew, it was good. It was just a lot and um, they had a really cute little girl. Um, I didn't really do any behind the scenes because I'm by myself and I didn't have an assistant. So. Okay, I went ahead and just pulled over so I could just get my bearings, um, like chugging some water. Good thing it wasn't like super hot out today or I'd be like sweating like a mother. And um, so I'm just going to show you some, just off of my camera, um, some shots that I got today. Okay, so I'm just going to click through. Um, I got a lot of cute ones of them like swinging their granddaughter. Super cute emotion. Then of course while I'm there, I'm going to get some headshots for people of the family. It's more like sibling shots, headshots, going through, siblings, uh, mother, daughter, uh, family, some really cute emotions, some more swinging, daddy, daughter. Yeah, so I'm really happy with the shot. She was so cute. Um, got some solo shots for her. I love getting a lot of variety for portrait sessions, um, getting as much as I can. So I meant to add also that for this shoot, I used all natural light. I used my 35 for the large group families and then switched my 85 for the smaller groups and individual photos. Uh, and I used those stools really came in handy. And the little girl loved the little elephant that I put on my lens, so I would say you should get one of these if you shoot kids. <laughs> okay, so I am also the photo and marketing specialist at Hoffman International Model and Talent Agency. Um, this is a great modeling agency. I love them so much. Uh, we are closed today, but I'm still here. So I thought it'd be fun to just show you guys a little bit inside look. Um, this is Kim Hoffman. She is our owner and president. Here is a wall of all of the Hoffman models, Angela Linval who started. If we go around this corner, um, this is my computer and my little phone. Um, this is where I work um, about four days a week doing photos and marketing for Hoffman. One thing I do at Hoffman is work on the portfolios for models. So that's fun. So another big thing that I do at Hoffman is work on the comp cards. So I grabbed a few comp cards that um, I shot these first images. And then on the back, um, I shot these two images. Mackenzie Evelyn shot this one. Um, I think I shot... Okay, now I am on Hoffman Models website because um, I do a lot of work with like choosing which images come up on this homepage and I'm working on models profiles. Um, so, let's look here. So if you go to Hoffman's website, you can see all of our talent. We have a lot of great talent starting age four and up. Um, so if you're looking for models or actors or even voiceover for any jobs or to test, uh, you should contact us. Uh, and if you are interested in modeling, um, Hoffman is a great place, as a great agency. Um, whether you are experienced or you need training, uh, we do offer training for our models. Um, so you should contact us if you want to be a model. One thing that I really love is wardrobe. So here's a look into my wardrobe closet. Um, I got this at a thrift store and I had a model wear this. This is from that photo I just posted. This dress is my mom's when she was a teenager. This beauty um, is my great-grandma's. I haven't used this yet or this. I got this at a thrift store. Um, just a lot of fun stuff. Um, I use a lot of the vintage stuff for models. And then I have a lot of gowns um, for maternity and beauty. With modeling shoots, I tell the models... Uh, 
what to bring, but then I will also pull from my own closet. So I get a lot of cool clothes from thrift stores. Savers is my favorite. Um, like I've used this sweater, I've gotten that, um, I've gotten this dress that I use. Ignore my crazy hair, but I just had to tell you that Savers, like I said, is my favorite thrift store and they are having a 50% off sale starting tomorrow and also Monday. So um, that's where I will be. You should go there too. So I also do a little bit of graphic design. My main thing is definitely photography, but at Hoffman, I design the ads. I design little invitations for things. Um, I also design a lot for Arbonne, Arbonne events. So I have a client and they're needing an invitation ASAP for an event that's coming up. They're wanting a piece of like paper on an envelope kind of look. So I'm in the very beginning stages of that. Um, you're gonna laugh, but I use Photoshop to design things, so. So I wanted to show you, as a portrait photographer, I offer these boxes. Um, this is the smallest box um, with the prints inside. Um, I mat these, get those printed, um, and had have them in here um, so you can have a keepsake. I also try to keep up to date on my blog, um, so I blog at least once a week. My latest blog post was my trip to LA with my beautiful friend Katie, and that was more of like a personal blog, um, and then I'll blog my shoots like with Linnea. So this was a really fun shoot with model Linnea, uh, we styled her like back to school, um, and then there's like another personal blog post, a maternity, um, I also do um, book reviews because I love to read. So if you're on my blog and you go to the side, you can see over here the different categories. So for example, if we go to Colette's library, it'll bring up all my book review posts. And then like I've said before, I also, I love clothes. So sometimes I do um, blog posts on different clothes that I have and different outfit inspiration. And to see all of those, you will go to Colette's Closet. Hey guys, so my phone died earlier, but um, my husband, he had a work party, so we were at that, and that was fun. Um, now we are home, my phone is charging, I'm ready for bed. I just want to say thank you so much for following me, it was fun today.